Welcome to the Kaplan EdTech Accelerator Demo Day. I'm Tom Leppert, and I have the privilege of serving as the CEO of Kaplan. That means every day I have the joy of working with about 22,000 people across the globe who are committed to education. We help students prepare for the ACT and the SAT in getting into the college of their choice and hopefully pursuing dreams of what they can be someday into the future. We work with nurses and doctors to help them prepare for licensing exams so that they can save our lives. We work with working moms, older students, non-traditional students, to help them climb up the economic ladder. And I might also point out, much different than your perception, we do it at a lower cost than traditional institutions and much more effectively. We also work with universities, institutions throughout the world in bringing international students to help diversify their student bodies, but also present those students with new opportunities. And we also work with companies, companies literally all across the world, in what we call lifelong learning, continue to prepare them for new opportunities and also to strengthen economies across the world. Whatever the line of business, at Kaplan there's a common thing, and that's education to improve people's lives. I've had the opportunity to work with large companies, lead companies, in a number of industries throughout the world. And I understand how important education is. It drives competitiveness for individual companies and countries. But I also had the opportunity to serve as the mayor of one of the largest cities in the nation. And I saw then the very personal side of education. And I saw where education, with all of the options, the short-term actions that are out there, Education is really the only way that you elevate an individual, a community, a country, or a society. That's why all of us at Kaplan are so passionate about education, and that's why I'm at Kaplan. We see it as a ministry. We see the work that we do each and every day elevating people and elevating communities. That's why we're so excited to be a lead today. You know, it wasn't too long ago that I had a chance to visit with each of the companies. And we talked about education today. And we talked about what an interesting crossroads we are at this point in time in history. You know, it doesn't matter where you go in the world. People understand how important education is today. Be it for political, sociological, or economic reasons. They understand how important education is. But it's also at that crossroads. Because for the first time in history, with technology, education can reach people that we were never able to reach before. That's why this is so exciting. And that's why what you'll see today is going to give you a look at what education is tomorrow. I can't think of a better organization to lead an effort like this than Kaplan. At Kaplan, we were the leaders, the pioneers in test preparation. We were one of the first offers of online education when people were actually trying to figure out what an internet was. We continue to be a leader in technology and innovation. In fact, Edward Hannipol, our chief information officer, Edward, where are you? Leads development of new platforms, new opportunities, and has been our executive lead on the EdTech. Sure, give him a hand, he deserves it. But just as important as the technology today is the focus on outcomes, the education meaning something, really producing results. We take pride in the fact that we put enormous dollars into learning sciences, not just asking what's new and faddish about education, but what really produces results. Roar Saxberg, our chief learning officer, is realized throughout the world is really the guru in learning science. Roar, where are you? Stand up and take a hand for all the work that you do. And finally, as you see the companies, you're going to see the unique qualifications of Kaplan as a global institution. New York, to London, to Lagos, to Dubai, to Singapore, to Sydney, and back around to Los Angeles. We take real pride in the fact that Fast Company named us as the third most innovative education company. Now, I think a lot of Fast Company 
They only missed it by two slots. <laughs> well, buckle up, because this is going to be an exciting day. This is our second class. First class had 10 companies. Those are all propelling to new heights. This effort started several months ago. We had literally hundreds of applications, hundreds of applications, some terrific ideas, interesting business plans. But what separates the 11 that you're going to see today is not just the great idea, but it's the passion for education and what they can do to change the world. Those 11 companies have been mentored by some of the best people that I know. 50 of the best people Kaplan's got are executives. And they've worked with them not only in terms of the business idea and creating the context that they'll need, be it with leaders in the education field, with school districts, with institutions, but they've also mentored them on a personal basis. A personal basis to ensure that those companies meet the personal goals and aspirations. So buckle up. Let's take a look at what the education landscape is going to be tomorrow. And to help us and to introduce those 11 companies is a good friend of Kaplan, Don Burton. Don is the managing director of the Kaplan EdTech Accelerator. He's got a great background in understanding how to work with companies and how to ensure that they blossom and develop. Don, thanks very much for everything you're doing. Let's get started and let's introduce the company.